Yo guys, what's going on and welcome to episode 11 of Owen and Owen. In this episode we are making Owen and Owen history because for the first time ever I have nothing to talk about at the start of a video. Apart from the small matter of the fact that we sold the baby Owen for 170,000 coins, which apparently completely slipped my mind when recording this episode. So yes, we, we did do that. Uh... Back to the video, I guess. To be fair, it has only been a week since the last recording. Future Stars Team 2 comes out tomorrow, uh, and I am going to save my packs, and I have some player picks as well, and I'm going to open those tomorrow. But once again, that will be at the end of the video. Hopefully, hopefully there's a Curtis Jones in there. By the time you're watching this video, you will know, and probably will have known for a long time whether there is. That's all, that's all I'm asking for, yeah, just a little Curtis Jones. Oh, yeah! But yeah, there is not really much for me to talk about. But regardless, let us jump into ONFC and see what is going on. Here we go then, and as I said, it is a Thursday today, which means it's Div Rival Rewards and Foot Champions Rewards. For some reason, I decided to do Foot Champs again last weekend. Uh, I got Silver 1 again. Silver 1 is what I aim for, because once I get my 11 wins, I do not want to play any more games just for my own mental health. However, I am very glad that I did, because this team of the week is quite a good one. Let me actually refresh my memory of what the team of the week is. So the big ones in the team of the week this week is a 90 rated Sterling, who would fit our team perfectly. Uh, but the main one, of course, is 87 Varan. I don't want to be that guy, because everyone uses Varan, Mendy, and you know what they say, if you can't beat him, join him. So I am actually, I'm actually very tempted to get Varane in the Owen and Owen team. So first things first, I think we will claim our Div Rival rewards and then our Foot Champions rewards. Div Rivals we got rank 2, I believe. So we're going to go for the untradeable packs because of course there's more packs. So we get two 25k packs and two 45k packs, which is actually a lot better than I thought they were going to be. So I'll take that. And as I said, we will open them tomorrow or for you watching the video, the end of the video or towards the end of the video. Anyway, I do have a plan in mind for this video, which you may be able to tell what it is by the title on the thumbnail. But yes, foot champions rewards. Then let's have a look. Silver one. 20k coins, a jumbo premium gold players pack, 50k pack, is that right? And a 35k pack, and of course, one player pick. So yes, we have our player pick. We have also got 581 plus player picks, as I said in the intro, but we're going to save those for tomorrow. These player picks, by the way, are incredible. By the time this video goes out, they probably would have gone from the store. I opened five of them off camera, and I got Courtois, Leroy Sane, Sula, Fernando, and another untradeable Papu Gomez, which is why we currently have an untradeable Gomez in our duplicates, because I'm going to use the other one in an SPC. Which SPC? Oh, I wonder. Foot Champions Red Player Picks. I feel like I'm going to, I'm calling it now, I'm going to get Almiron, Lingard, or Perrin. That's what I, one of those three cards will pop up. Obviously, I, I really want a Varane, but so does everyone, obviously. And I'll be over the moon with a Sterling as well. But beyond that, 83 and above, I'm going to say. 83 and above. Come on, let's go. Player pick time. I told you we'd get short. Almiron, Lingard, or Perrin. I told you we'd get short. That's not strictly true, is it? I think I might take him as well because he does actually fit my team. Yeah, I think I'm going to take Luke Shaw. Actually, let me check their prices first. Let, let me make the sensible decision. Shaw is going for 28. Thousand coins and Paulista 21,000 coins. So Luke Shaw is the most expensive. I mean, out of curiosity, how much is Angelino? But I'm not going to take him. Yeah, 17 and a half. So, no, thank you. So, based on price, I'm thinking Luke Shaw. Here's a man new player, but do you know what? He's playing really well. Even as a Liverpool fan wearing a Liverpool kit, I am going to say that Luke Shaw is playing very, very well. Welcome to ONFC, Luke Shaw. Now, as I said, I don't think there's anything else for me to talk about, which means we can just jump into the first game of the episode. So let's remind ourselves of ONFC. It is looking lovely. There it is. Michael Owen, how's he doing after his first weekend league? The goals for game ratio has slipped a little bit. It was almost two goals for every game, but he has played 31, scored 47, got five assists. Let us jump into the first game of the day, I think we're going to play two games again because, as I said, I do have more content to add to the end of the video. So we're going to play two games, and without further ado, let's jump into the first one right now. Okay, first team of the day. Joe Gomez off chem, Ginter off chem, Testegen off chem, 
Dybala off Ken, but he has got Drogba up front. I've never played against a Drogba before. The team that looks fairly beatable, I would say. So, let's try and do just that. Oh, Ronald, don't get done like that. Well done. To Owen. Oh, he's passed to Gomez. First chance, first goal for Michael Owen, of course. Sprint past Joe Gomez like he's not even there. You love to see it, and we're one the up inside six minutes. Owen. Oh, he takes massive... That's what I've noticed about Owen. When he turns, he takes massive touches. But if he can get on the end of it, usually you're all right. Go on, Grealish. What have you got, lad? Love that. Inside. There's Alan. Can he poke it through? He can. Owen is here. Owen is here. See what I mean? Look at that massive touch. But he's past Joe Gomez. He's going to finesse. Oh, to Stegen with the fingertip save. Oh, unlucky, mate. Ronald, quick on the attack. And by attack, I mean defend. Oh, into Grealish. What a block. Oh, Grealish just won it back. Oh, Jack. Oh, stop it, Jack. Oh, Jack Grealish. Pop it up to the back post. Oh, in! <gasps> Thank you, Pulisic. I was going to be very mad. I was going to be fuming. How was little Michael Owen won a header but then hit the bar? You can't do that to him. But Pulisic tucks in the rebound, if you can call it a rebound. Sancho. Oh, Davies, where you going, lad? Sancho. Oh, Jaden. Oh, wow. If, you could, if you'd buried that, that, that would have been in like Wayne Rooney's skill school, that was. Oh, he's done me there. He hasn't done Ron Oh. <laughs> Played out wide. Exactly where Wijnaldum wants him, but he's still somehow managed to squeeze the... Oh, he's bridged me! We don't panic. We don't panic. We are 2-0 up. Come on. Play it. Yes. Grealish. No. Gomez is ready. Oh. Chop. Grealish. Goal. Love that. Jack Grealish. Come on, lad. He looks like a character from Sonic the Hedgehog with his hair cut, but what a finish from the lad. Oh, he's done me there. Oh, he's done me there. Oh, good finish. Well, fair enough. Fair enough. Good finish. We go again. 3-1. Owen, look at that. The massive touch again. Ah, uh, Half time. 3-1. Good first half. And to be fair, credit to this guy for not leaving at 3-0 down, because he did then go on to score. Eight shots, seven on target. The one that was off target hit the crossbar. So we're doing pretty well so far. Oh, Sancho's got space. Owen's somehow got the ball. Don't really know what's happened there. Owen. Still Owen. Inside. Takes massive touches. <laughs> Sancho wins the ball back to Jack Grealish. He picks it up to Owen with the... I'm not 100% sure how he's missed that, to be honest. Oh, Roma Gnoli. Coming like a steam train. Pulisic. Go. Run. Oh, that would be nice. He's offside. You know what? I'm going to make some subs. I'm going to try out Dest to start off with. I'm also going to take off Grealish. Bring on Awa. Do you know what? Let's give Lozano a run out as well. Here is Dest again. Playing a lovely ball to Lozano. The substitutes linking up. Lozano. Still to Owen. He's been quite unlucky in front of goal today. Oh, that's in the second half. A goal of second half. You don't see that very often. But we come away victorious. 3-1. Owen should have got more than one. Did he only score one this game? He should have got more than one. He was robbed. I'm not going to lie. He was robbed. We take it, Dest came on. Very good, actually. I liked him a lot. But yeah, good good performance all round, really. Well done. Well done, everyone. Right, another foot founder. Of course it was. I am the foot founder of Magnet in this game. More than happy with that. And with that being said, let us move on to the second game of the episode. <laughs> team 2. Oh, uh, an interesting team for what is middle February. Uh, just a normal Prem team. Aubameyang, Son... Joe Gomez, obviously. You're just a very, very normal team. You love to see it, right? Let's go, boys. <laughs> this game. 
What a, what a through ball from Aubameyang. Oh he's, oh, he's got two men over here. Kleiber. Watching Son. Um, um, good save, Jan Luigi. Oh my lord, how have you got a goal kick out of that? Striker! <laughs> Ambitious. Sancho's making the run. What a pass. Sancho, you've been done by Alex Tellez, your own teammate. He's, he's basically got a lot of my players in his team. Oh, Grealish, we get a bit lucky. We get a bit lucky. Jack Grealish, what a save from Edison. We, we did get a bit lucky. This is definitely a closer game than the first. Definitely a closer game than the first. We're quite evenly matched. Yoink! Oh, what's going on? How has he tackled me there? He was literally behind me. Well done, Tellers. Well done. Oh, good ball as well. Oh, Jesus. Mate, nothing is falling my way. Nothing's falling my way this game. Mate, honestly, nil-nil at half-time. The only reason it's so close is because he's relatively good at FIFA and because nothing's going my way this game. I'm being tackled from behind. I'm being tackled before I even have the ball. We go again. We do not let this get us down. Owen has had very limited chances because Joe Gomez is a machine. Owen finds Grealish. Oh, we've done Joe Gomez, surely Jack Grealish. There we go, the deadlock has been broken. Owen with a rare assist to Jack Grealish. Lovely, it was coming, it was coming. First proper chance we have, first goal. you love to see it, come on. Just try and do it ticky tackle like us. Try and do it ticky tackle like us. It's working. Oh, it's worked. Donnarumma, and it's fallen straight to his feet. It literally bounced off him straight to his feet. Well, it looks like the game is not on our side this half. We have to go again. Oh, that's a, no, that's a panna. That's a foul ref. He didn't... Oh, mate. Oh, genie. Grealish is nice. Nope. Joe Gomez, man, just leave me alone. This is what I mean. I'm getting for Ram, boys. I don't care. Oh, my keeper's not going to come out for that, is he? Of course he's not. Right. So somehow that's worked. Good save. And it's fallen to his feet again. I do not believe it. It's fallen straight to his feet again. Oh. Right, we're making some subs. So let's bring on Dest again. The same subs as the first game. Can they change this game around? I hope so. Oh, it's just not going our way, this game. This is not going our way. Come on, Alan. Drive. Owen, oh, please. I don't really know what to say anymore, boys. I don't actually. I actually don't know what to say. Oh, surely, bit of skill, Pulisic. You love to see it. Come on, come on. Two, two, eighty-third minute. There is time to win it. There's also time to lose it, probably, and we probably will. Donnarumma, well done. Thank you. Jesus, how's your touch, witch? Fair enough, we managed to scrape a draw from it, so we'll take it, you know. Owen was, uh, was just man-marked out of the game completely by a stupid, stupid Joe Gomez card. Ah, uh, but we move, we move. Goals from Grealish and Pulisic. Assists coming from, both of them from Owen. I started this episode saying he doesn't get assists and he gets two in the same game. Yeah, fair enough, right. Well, we move. Foot founder again. Right, so there we go. That is going to do it in terms of the gameplay for this episode. But as I said, the video is not over. We do have the Div Rival Rewards, the Foot Champions Rewards, and the five player picks to open. So let's jump in and finish off the episode. Okay, here we go. It is now Friday, and as you can see on the screen, Future Stars Team 2 has been released. And in my opinion, this is much 
much better than Team 1. The actual team itself looks pretty good, I'm not going to lie. The Ansu Fati looks absolutely broken. Saka as well looks very good, I know Robbie's happy with that, being an Arsenal fan. And then I was disappointed, because as you can see, there is no Curtis Jones in the team, and all I asked for EA was a Curtis Jones. And then I went to the SPCs, I had a look, and there he is, Curtis Jones SBC. It's, a, it's an 83, an 85 and an 86 rated squad, but the actual cards themselves look absolutely nuts. There's a left mid version which I'm not going to go for, but 90 pace, 90 dribbling, he looks very good, but I'm going to go for the centre mid. All stats 80 and above, he's in the Hullet gang. Now, the breakdown of his stats, there is one yellow stat in his entire stats and it's free kicks and I've got Koeman for free kicks I don't need anyone else to take free kicks for me safe to say I'm getting this card regardless of how much money it will cost me <laughs> so that leads me on to the player picks now these have been nerfed apparently the first batch I opened it did five off camera and I got two walkouts two boards no two walkouts and three boards but I'm just looking for fodder really if we could get a future star that'd be great but I'm just looking for fodder let's let's start the first pick is, well, I mean that's fodder, 84 Perrin, come on, yes, yes please, what a pick, pick number two. A, a, what, yes, Nsame, okay, Nsame, Nsame, two 84 informs that are two picks. Next pick, the shiny head himself. Look how shiny it is from the sides. <laughs> <laughs> oh my lord. The UCL version this time. Okay, maybe these haven't been nerfed as much as I thought they had been. You see, well, I, I knew as soon as I said that, I knew as soon as I said that I'm going to get absolutely stiffed. All right, we'll go for Kolarov. Because I might have a tradable duplicate version. And last player pick. Okay. It went downhill a little bit, but I take Kragnall obviously because he's the only one I haven't got. 384s, technically they're all walkouts, very happy with that. Right, now let's move on to the packs. Here we go then, we do have 12 packs in the store from various different things. I'll probably, for the sake of time, I'll probably only show you the good ones. But yeah, we've got some pretty decent packs. We've got a couple 45Ks, we've got some 50Ks. I have a conspiracy theory that 45K packs are a scam. But we're going to open them anyway. So yeah, let's let's just jump into it. I don't really know which pack is which. So let's just let's get started. Can we pack ourselves a future stars? Not in this one. Is it a board? It's not a board. It is left mid Lamar. We do also have a slab head, another forehead. We've got yeah a lot of foreheads in this pack. Right, let's just keep tearing the packs open. You know, let's just keep going. We'll get if we get a good one, then that's a both. Oh, speaker walk out. Oh my, I thought it was a future stars, but it's just a blue, so it's probably going to be a fake. Jimenez, yeah, fake walkout, but fodder, can't complain. He is going straight in the Curtis Jones SBC. Got Visca as well in the pack, two boards, take that. All right, we've had a walkout already, it was a fake walkout, but you know, take a walkout nonetheless. Didn't get a single walkout in the last pack opening, in the last episode. Not a board, it is... So many slab heads today. It was a board. Danish goalkeeper, Schmeichel. 84, that's fodder we take. Fodder. We need the fodder for the Curtis Jones. You love to see it. Don't know why that one looks more yellow than the others. Argentina, centre mid. Benega. It's a board. He's a board. It's fodder. It's the definition of fodder. He's just not usable anywhere else. Last pack then. Mega pack. Come on. Come on the walkout. Come on the future stars. No walkout. That is a shame. Is that an inform? No, it is not. It is Suso. So there we go. The packs are all gone. Uh, the pack club was better than last week. Well... Better than the packs I opened on camera last week. I then packed the future stars off camera. Hopefully I can do that again. Uh, I, but I doubt it. However, I'm not going to end this video just yet. Because if you've looked at the title and thumbnail, 
Did you know there is one more thing that we have to do? Okay, and we're gonna finish this video off with what I'm assuming is probably gonna be the title and the thumbnail. We are going to be completing the Wayne Rooney end of an era SBC. I have done two of the three teams already, as you can see, but the other team I submitted, I submitted uh, Son, Aguero, because they're very high rated and they don't really get used very often. But the last team, we are saying goodbye to and Papu Gomez, obviously, because we have a duplicate one. Uh, Sane, we have his ones to watch on loan, and the only place I'd use him would be in friendly, so I can just use the loan. And then everyone else is fairly cheap, to be honest. So, this is it. The final squad for end of an era, Wayne Rooney. What an upgrade this is to the team, by the way. What an upgrade. Thumbnail secured. Here he is. The big man himself, Wayne Rooney. We have a 93 Rooney to add into our team. That is amazing. Right, so there you go. That is where I'm going to end this video. So if you guys have enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like down below. Subscribe if you are new around here. And I will see you all in my next video. See ya.